very most common starter stage here. I even dubbed it Starter Stadium myself. You know, we had we had Starterville in Smash 4, now it's Starter Stadium. Yeah, I haven't gone like anywhere else today. <laughs> I, I, I mean, went, I, I, I went mostly PS2. I mean, I yeah, ban FD and Yoshi's. I ban Yoshi's every single set. There's not a set that I don't ban Yoshi's. Yeah, I'm good off that. But here we go. CSS going against the weak. The Con Con Agnologia. See how it goes. Immediately Agnologia opening up with that neutral air. Leading into the forward air. The Con Con jumping down with that neutral air. We have the flip kick able to come in and save Agnologia there. Yeah, that's going to be a good tool for Agnologia to have in the matchup for sure. If he's getting uh, combo too hard, it's kind of a get, get out of free, jail free card. Alright, just going to jab out of that situation. Not the hardest yep. punish, the turn around show you can, man. I mean, I was talking about hard punish. That's the hardest you can have. You gotta be careful when your opponent has an option like that to do anything super unsafe oh, on yeah. the shield. They are going to make you pay. And Luigi mains are definitely all over that. They are already holding bump up after oh, shield. Oh yeah, for sure. Look at that Zare off the platform. Really good. He was able to drop through with it. Okay, Kong. <laughs> Covers a low <laughs> option as well on the ledge. Forcing Agnologia to go high. So many just plungers coming oh, out. There's yep. a hitbox. And it lands down. And I think that's the craziest Woo! thing, especially at the ledge. Hong Kong is just going He's the short hop on that plunger. And it lasts for so long on that ledge that it gets past oh, no. the regular get -up. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, I saw. I, he wanted it so bad. <laughs> All right, but Agnologia is still in it right here. Down two stocks. Back air. Still not going to take it away, though. Has to recover low. Kong Kong back onto the stage now. Another back there there from Agnologia sending him to the other side. Uh, he hasn't really found a, a, a good way to edge guard Kong Kong or even ledge trap him. Mostly just uh, deciding to let him get back and play the neutral out. Well, even though Luigi's recovery is there, it's actually still quite hard right. to go ahead and catch him. Especially when he's coming through so deep. Down below, because one misstep, you're getting hit by that coin. You might end up getting coin gift. That is very true. That should be it. The down throw into the tornado. Oh yeah, I heard that plunger. That's a that's a solid three stock coming out from Kong Kong, and that's a good combo, man. That that tornado is so so strong. It's fun times, fun times. Good, but good stuff. Yeah, Kong Kong getting that W. That's the world we have to think about. Possible counter break. He's just running it back to PS2. But Real quick. We see a different character. Real quick. I mean, it, like I said, I think the Lucina is a much better matchup. But it's if this happening. is his most experienced character, then I'm not surprised to see this at all. Uh, definitely believe that Agnolovia can clean it up a little bit more. He, he had some solid moments in that first game. Just wasn't able to find the the perfect openings to get the, the hard punishes. Like he, he was getting hits in neutral for sure. Trading is there and a fireball. Oh my oh, goodness, but no. Kong ends up getting that grab, looking for a forward smash boss. He's got spot dots coming in for Agnologia. Dash attack, sending him right back off stage for the Cyclone. Catching the flip kick as well. Yeah, really good traps here from Mr. Con Con. Oh, he's, he's forcing Agnologia to go higher, do something else. Like I said, that plunger lasts Ooh. so long off of his there. Again, the up B taking it away. Now, we were talking about that just in game number one. He can't do anything too unsafe on uh, zero, on Luigi's shield. Oh, no. He's going to eat a hard punish. Almost got the gimp there as well. Oh, he gets that last hitbox on that neutral, leading into the dash attack as well. Hong Kong is carrying off where he left off in that last game. Oh, okay. He can't hang on there for too long because he's going to get hit by the plunger. Up air. Sending Hong Kong off of the platform. Oh, but the flip kick off the mark, unfortunately. Forward smash is going to connect, though. You get a back air? Yes, but the green missile coming in. Hong Kong, able to get back onto the stage. Oh my god, Kong Kong is really going for it. Oh, wow! No, that's so unfortunate. Yeah. Agnologia. Ooh, okay. You know what? <laughs> Overextending just a little. He let him taunt for a minute, too. He was like, alright, I got you. I got you. Oh, he's taunting. I'm going to jab you afterwards, though. <laughs> oh, my god. That short hop down. Stop. <laughs> Alright, that uh, side B, the side special, pretty good. 
when you hold it out, it actually pops your opponent upwards so you can get some juggles. Man, Magnalogia definitely powering up right here. He's gonna need a hard punish though. Over committing with the boost kick. Very easy up special coming out from Con Con. And he's gonna get the double three stock. Ouch. And you know, that's how it be sometimes, man. Especially against these really, really good players who have been playing Smash for over a decade. Mm -hmm. And have been, you know, oh yeah, Kong Kong is top of their class. Veteran. You cannot yeah. come in with no jankiness. He will scope it out at any time, as we saw there. Like, I mean, like especially with Luigi, you do anything safe off on their 